Yeah, we got the LPGA. It's LPGA week in Williamsburg. A lot of great golf as always this year, but something a little different about the event at Kings Mill. Tighter title sponsor Pure Silk is on board the Pure Silk Championship. The course is enough of a challenge that one of the top ranked players in the world usually wins here. Six former champions are back. The number one player in the world is here, but it's about more than just the golf. The LPGA is doing a better job at humanizing the players. Here's former champ Lizette Salas. We were just known as just robots out here and we're more than just athletes. We're daughters, we're moms, we're, um, we're business, um, business owners. Like we're just, we're far more than just athletes. There are also moms to be like two-time major champion Brittany Linsicum. This is her last event of the season. Everyone's like, you're going to enjoy the downtime, enjoy the next four months. Like, it's going to go by super fast. I'm more selfish. I'm worried about picking up a lot of weight because I'm not going to be golfing <laughs> every day of my life, you know, walking six, seven miles a day. Aria Jatanagarn is the defending champion here. She's from Thailand and one of the top players in the world. Filmmakers wanted to make a movie about her and are. She was a bit hesitant at first. But I want to know, like, why they want to do this movie. But after they told me, like, you know what, they just want to inspire the kids in Thailand, I, I just say yes right away. Good. The Women's U.S. Open is next week in Charleston. This is a good place to tee it up before then. The golf course is one of the best golf courses we play all year, so uh, especially leading up to the U.S. Open, I think it's a great place to be. In the meantime, it's Kings Mill this week, and the event made even better now that they finally found their title sponsor, Pure Silk. So when they came on on board, I just knew it was going to be um, an extraordinary event from start to finish. All right, the Pro-Am is tomorrow. First round tees off bright and early Thursday morning. Of course, the final round is Sunday.